In Jesus Christ, in today's gospel, we can see two reactions to the human needs. So firstly, we can see the reaction of the disciples. So this, the disciples could see that the people were hungry and they were very tired. And if they are being sent out, they, will, they may faint and so on. So knowing those things, so what they wanted, they began to worry about it. Who is going to feed them? Who, who is going to have money? And if you have a huge amount of money, daily wages, which will be compared, you know, more than two months or three months or even five years, six years. If you have that much amount of money, even uh, with that, you cannot feed these people. So they begin to worry. And then they wanted to send those people away so that they themselves will buy some food for them. And uh, this was their intention and this was their re reaction towards the need of those people at that time. And they came to Jesus and began to say, uh, you can tell them to go and so on. So this was the first reaction. And second reaction is that from the part of Jesus. So looking at Jesus, knowing that the people were very tired and they, are, they were very hungry, they began to... He began to have concern for them, so he wanted to feed them. Because you no, know, if you send them away, then they may faint, faint on the on the way. So it was a deserted place. So for the Jews, they have a custom. They used to bring some food. They used to take some food when they go for a traveling. Because uh, if they buy some food, they think that okay, it is not holy, it is profane. So then. If they themselves carry some food for them, so it will be holy, it will, it, will, it will not be defiled. So for that reason, they carry food. On those times, those people would have carried some food. They, they could have had carried some food. And uh, for some people, so they could have finished the food. Some could have had some food or the bread, which means... So the remaining people, those who... Uh, finished the food or uh, finished the the bread they were feeling hungry so looking at their condition so they are very tired they are very they feeling very hungry so jesus began to have concern for them and wanted to give them something to eat and then he was asking the disciples do you have something what do you have if you have something give them something to eat and the the the, the, the disciples were concerned about we will send them away. No? They will buy something for themselves to eat. But for Jesus, give them something to eat. Difference. Two reactions to the people need. So what reaction do I have when I see the people in need? So people I see, they have nothing to eat. They have nothing to eat. Am I able to give them something? Or am I able to send them away? Go and ask somebody else. In the railway station, in the bus stand. Uh, wherever the place people gather where people gather the poor people they come collect asking for some money asking for some food are we able to give some food to them or are we are we sending them away go and ask somebody or are we ignoring them you know there are times uh, even i take sometimes initiative to give some food to people because you know i try to go I have a passion to do it, but I have not get into that particular uh, spirit of uh, feeding those people in need. But uh, I also need to practice, dear friends. I also need to practice uh, to help those people in need who do not have food, who do not have sh clothing, shelter and so on. It is going to be a great challenge, dear friends, like Jesus, looking at Jesus and uh, following his words, his steps, in his steps, you know, it's not... Uh, it will not come within a day. It may take many days. It may take many weeks, months, years and so on. But we need to constantly practice, dear friends, the attitude of Jesus in our life so that we also will do, uh, you know, we also will react to the need of people as Jesus reacted. Reacted in the sense, he helped them. He gave them food. He gave them shelter. He gave he gave them the energy, he gave them the strength, the teaching, being a shepherd. And he taught them the spiritual nourishment, the physical nourishment, the psychological nourishment. And also the physical physical nourishment he gave them through the bread. Dear friends, let us also be like Jesus, helping the people who are in need. Let us react to the people in need 
with the reaction of Jesus as that we find in today's gospel. So that our life will be very bright, dear friends. Thank you.